be in the middle of the map. You actually want to be nowhere near them because you are going to evaporate, simply put, as he did um, in that situation. That's what I was talking about. Strategically, balanced can kill anyone on Cajun Trinket's side. If Tittery uses his ice blocks to stop CC, if Cajun Red Buff has to Trinket to stop CC or stop damage, uh, they can easily take him out. There was one point in that game that Cajun, um, at the end, dropped the smoke bomb onto Valet to stop his damage, but Raikou was there with follow-up damage. I think that they might want to consider using their smoke bomb strictly defensively and put it, plop it right on the Doomson as soon as he gets swapped to because it's basically another bark skin. Not only will it prevent damage from coming in if they're not inside of it, it also reduces damage. So if they use it, it's very hard to get a good smoke bomb against this kind of composition because balanced are going to be playing very stuck together. They're never really going to separate, so you can't expose them with the smoke bomb. I'd like to see them use it strictly for defensive measure if they decide to go after Doomson the way that they did previously. Full sap on the healing stat, cheap shot onto Valet, pretty standard opener from Cajun Trinket. Now into the half yard kidney shot, Valet trinkets that puts Cajun into a full fear are they going to set up on the Cajun red buff is the question it looks like the target for right now is fully dotted Valet still down at 60% trying to heal through the pressure Doomson gets silenced horrify under red buff here down to 40% the NS comes out from Doomson he pre iron barks the uh, full hodge but will it be enough the frozen orb is just cutting him in half right now down to 14% cloak of shadows has to be used as the full polymorph was landed onto Doomson Cajun red buff looking to desperately get a restealth has to use the vanish instead trying to silence both casters right now lands a full kidney shot pops the Adrenaline Rush gets bopped immediately, trying to make a turnaround on the Cajun Red Buff, down to 24%. Valet pumping out so much damage right now. Raikou Frostbolt him as well. He does manage to shadow step defensively back to Doomson. Doomson should be able to uh, top him off here very shortly. You can see Tittery now pulling back as well. Uh, they did blow through the Adrenaline Rush, which means that Cajun Red Buff's Red Buff is going to be a lot harder to build up. And Healing Stat Valet, the crossing center field, looking to get some CC onto Doomson. They need to get his trinket out with the next setup. Healing Stat gets cheap shot into a full polymorph. Now a cheap shot onto Valet. Kidney shot onto Valet as well. Now the uh, Frost onto Raikou. Raikou actually blocks out of that to go for a Polymorph. He's not able to get it just yet. It looks like they're setting up on the Cajun Red Buff. Once again, no cloak for 10 seconds. Will he be able to survive? Both players have their trinket. They're both trying to hold on to it. Doomson gets horrified. Horrified's not going to be available for Cajun Red Buff. Doomson gets the NS off. Stabilizes him. Full blind on the healing stat. Trinket set immediately. The Iron Bark has to be used as well. Full kidney shot onto Valet. Both Cajun Red Buff and Valet are in a lot of trouble right now. Healing stat into a Poly. Into a half clone. He trinkets into that half clone. Valet down to 30%. The bomb has to be used with the Aura Mastery to spam out the heals. Unfortunately, though, both interrupts weren't available. Maybe a bit of a wasted Aura Mastery there, or just trying to reduce the incoming damage with it. Uh, regardless, Aura Mastery having to be blown and Healing Stat having to trinket as well. Now Bubble is the only thing standing between them. Uh, full Horrifying to Doomson. They're making another Korean swap. Fear onto both DPS. He bark skins immediately, but into the full deep freeze. Tittery needs to peel for him. He has to keep him alive. This is going to be it if he doesn't do it. It doesn't look like he's going for peels. Smoke Bomb comes out both defensively and offensively, and Doomson's going to be able to line of sight. Lands a full clone out of the deep freeze. Valet down to 40%. Goes for the master spell. Gets kicked on it by Cajun Red Buff. Into the half clone. Valet down to 21%. Disperses at 17%. Healing stat gets garroted on his Avenging Wrath. He's not able to connect the big heal just yet. Tittery needs to land a full poly right now to end the game. Doesn't look like he has it. Uh, goes for the counter spell, but he misses it, unfortunately. And that means that Healing stat is going to be able to top off Valet. As I say that, though, Healing stat actually gets locked up by Cajun Red Buff. Uh, down to 60%. Healing stat into a deep freeze. Unfortunately, breaks to the Ice Nova. Now, Frost Draw on the Healing Stat. Tittery just not able to land the Polymorph yet. There's the full Polymorph landed. Killing Spree comes out immediately onto Valet. He's trying to go for that Master Spell. He fakes the kick. He gets gouged on the follow-up. Tries to go for the MD again. He connects the Master Spell. Tittery in a huge turnaround. Down to 28% with Triple CC on the Cajun Trinket. Even though Valet was under so much pressure with no dispersion, they managed to make a turnaround and get an Ice Block out from Tittery. Doomson still holding on to his Trinket, though. Feeling pretty comfortable right now as he goes into that full silence. But a full Kidney Shot onto Valet. Down to 45%. Healing Stat desperately spamming Flash Shield after Flash Shield. Valet gets cloned up at low HP. Tittery gets locked on his poly. Goes for the Frost Draw instead. Not able to land it though. And with that CC chain getting broken up, Valet should be able to stabilize here in the back line. Cajun trying to kick Healing Stat right now. Throws him into the full gouge. Uh, it's going to DR the Polymark, but maybe they just want to go for some instant CC instead. A full fear on to Cajun. Doesn't land it on to Tittery though. And Tittery is able to just spam Polymark after Polymark onto Raikou to peel. Full kidney shot on the healing stat, full garrote silence onto uh, Valet, trying to make something happen here very shortly. But they throw the Horrify onto Tittery, he trinkets out of that immediately, and he's able to interrupt the Polymorph chain from Raikou onto Doomson. Well played from Tittery to shut down that CC. Healing stat in the meantime, using this bubble, seeing that there's a lot of damage coming in right now from Cajun, uh, spam healing him with that bubble. He doesn't want to have to use his Avenging Wrath just yet. His trinket coming up for that blind, he goes into the full blind. He's sitting through it for now, but there's no dispersion for 15 seconds. Will this cost him the game? He ends up trinketing it half. 
halfway through. There's the silence. Double fear onto both DPS. Who is Valet going to go for for the target here? Seems like Tittery is the target of choice as the Devouring Play goes up. Valet trinkets out of the full kidney shot. Cajun Red Buff, Cloak of Shadowing uh, to save his teammate there, which means he doesn't have it if they want to swap. Doesn't look like they want to, though. Doomson Trinkets, he uses the Iron Bark. Will it be enough? No, the second Ice Block needs to be popped as well out from Tittery. And suddenly, Balanced have a huge cooldown lead. Uh, Valet with his Dispersion and Tittery with nothing right now. Doomson with no Trinket either. Uh, they Both teams are dancing on the edge here. Double Fear onto both DPS. Doomson lands a clone onto Raikou. They need some CC on the healing set. There's the full poly with no way out. Can they connect the damage is the question. Cajun Red Buff pops that Adrenaline Rush. Tons of Sinister Strikes flying in fast right now onto Valet. Down to 53%. Into the full clone onto healing stat. Great CC chain out from Cajun. They need to keep it going if they want to win this game though. Killing Spree comes out. Healing stat or Master. He tries to spam the CC. Or sorry, the heals out to save him. A DR gouge on the healing stat, but he's going to be able to survive. Tittery in the meantime with no ice blocks needs to blink and play defensively, but they managed to get the dispersion out of the way nonetheless. But a full fear has landed onto Doomson. Are they going to make a swap onto him is the question. Doesn't look like it. Going after Cajun Red Buff. He needs to cloak. Down to 20. Down to 19. Drops the smoke bomb. Down to 11. Down to 8. Very boldly holding onto that cloak of shadows. The iron bark gets used instead by Doomson to reduce that damage. Cajun needs to be able to stick onto his target if they want to end the game, but that iron bark now is not available for Tittery. Doomson into the full deep freeze. They managed to interrupt the polymorph though, stopping the CC. Doomson desperately trying to spam heal him with these regrows right now. Blinks away from the incoming CC as well. Uh, healing stat with no trinket for 20 seconds. They need to set something up, but they can't. They're just so low. Down to 5%. Ice Lance connects. Dooms and heal. Please save him. He just needs to survive for two more seconds. But the full Horrify connects, and that's going to be it. Balance, take game number two over Cajun Trinket and progress forward into round number three. Tune in for the next series here very shortly as I set them up. Thank you guys for tuning in. This is ESL Go for WoW Cup number seven. I'm so in love with you. I'm so in